had the, the dark nature of the plot. And yet, we still have characters that have a little bit of life in them, a little bit of a spark. Um, you know, we have a joke area now and then. Um, and I, I think that's really important to keeping the atmosphere just light enough to keep on wanting to go through it, you know? Alright, Shawnee, where you at? Ready for the autopsy? Let's get started. Alright, so how do we do this? Race, human. Gender, male. Wounds, extensive. Shani, this isn't a lecture hall. Whatever you say. He died yesterday, torn to pieces. Could a human have inflicted these wounds? Only with a two-foot jaw. A werewolf? The moon's shining. Wouldn't he turn into a lycanthrope? I guess. Geralt, no need to test me. I'm a professional. Moving on. The bone marrow has been sucked out. Must be scavengers. Very likely. Plenty around the cemetery. So, he was torn to pieces after he died. I'm interested in the cause of death. I also see some stab wounds. A blade... two fingers wide. Something's wrong. His head's in an unnatural position, his hands twisted. The wounds can't explain that. Some kind of fit? No indication of other symptoms. Poison, maybe. But then why would someone stab him? We'll find out. Let's check his internal organs. He wasn't killed with a weapon. What next? Check the liver. Completely cirrhotic. A strong poison affected the nervous system. Practically unavailable. For an alchemist? A gifted alchemist could obtain it. I need proof. Alchemical poisons cause certain changes. Tends to the King Cox scene. Look, the tongue was crudely extracted, but not all the blackened tissue was removed. Blackened? Yes, the poison caused necrosis of the tongue, so the murderer removed it. So we're certain a gifted alchemist is the murderer. A gifted alchemist? Who's a crappy surgeon? Kalkstein. He wanted to implicate the bandits, but he failed to foresee a professional autopsy. Thanks, Shani. That's the evidence I needed. Good. I'm exhausted. Interesting. Let's go have a chat with our buddy Kalkstein. Also, she, uh, she had a brief appearance in the book that I read, so I know that she already has a romantic history with Geralt. Uh, it's old crone again. Ugh. Where are you? I'm here to see Shani. Sits in our room. Uh-huh. Hawk. Uh-huh. Will you take... Be silent and let me pass. Get out! But... Oh my gosh, this old lady. Yeah, yeah. What's I'm here. To they send you. F yes. You can go. Mm, old age right. is no jest. Thank you, old lady. Yes. You need any help? I'd like to ask a favor. I'm listening. Remember Dandelion? Well, 
We're trying to organize a gathering. A gathering? To reminisce, have a few drinks. However... Lacking the drinks? You guessed it. And I don't want to serve just anything. What do you need? Cherry vodka for dandelion, rosé wine for me, and something for you. I have all those things. I'll try. I think. Pretty sure. Yes? Bye. Rosé wine, cherry liquor, and Mary and Rye vodka. I have... Very old wine. There's Rosé wine. Cherry liquor. And... I know it's Mary and Rye vodka. That's what I need. I can get that from the end. But first... We need to complete our investigation. Hey! Lay off, punks! Hit! Kill! Oh, why am I, why am I attacking the dwarf? What's going on? Bastard. Hmm. I suspected you were working with Javed. You think I lead Salamandra? I'll die laughing. I'm certain. You don't fool me with your scholarly guys. You're a fool, Geralt. You offended me, Witcher. You offended me, Witcher. Mike, you offended me, Witcher. No, so he doesn't want to talk to me anymore at all. Wow. Okay. Well, I didn't expect that. that he is a suspect. So far, um, I believe everyone else's story is above his. But then again, he's also been attacked by the Salamandra, so I don't know. Why is my medallion always rattling when I come in here? Yes? I have the autopsy results. And? I'm certain it was Kalkstein. How do you know? The liver was cirrhotic. The stab wounds were just a clumsy attempt to hide the real reason. So, poison after all. But how can you be sure it was Kalkstein? Changes in the eyeballs, typical of alchemical poisons. I see you did your homework. I sure did. Come back later. I need to analyze this information. All right. While you analyze, I'm going to go to the tavern and get a drink. I like the balancing of items and inventory in this game. Uh, there's plenty of different items, you know, gifts for, like, flowers, um, red shawls, and, uh, foods, wines, all that kind of thing. Um, but it's not an overwhelming amount. Um, I know that when I was playing Dragon Age Inquisition recently, there were many times where a quest would say, here, you need a logging stand, here you need uh, XYZ ingredients or reagents. They give me no indication whatsoever of where I can find them. And uh, it was just overwhelming. Here, I've got a pretty good idea of just about where I can buy everything. 
Barbarian ride. Cool. All right. Do have a rendezvous with Shawnee. Looking forward to meeting Dandelion, too. He's a pretty big character in the books. gifts those two times if she's like my birthday or whatever then um, we'd be on good terms and again I don't know she's such a schizoid sometimes she's just nice to me and sometimes she's she hates me what's I'm here yes you can go Tavern, maybe? Confused. Where, where, where'd you go? She downstairs, maybe? Oh, oh, hello. See, you slipped into something a little more comfortable. Yes. I brought some liquor. Splendid. Bring a friend. See you at the party. I invite one person to Shani's party. Sultan seems like a good friend. She's gonna. I guess she's going to bed. She's changing into her jammies. Shani. 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 Yeah. Talk to me. Shani. What about this party? Invited anyone yet? Not really. We're waiting on you. Maybe I'll invite my detective friend. Here at last. Mm -hmm. Listen, I got it all figured out. Cal Steen and Ramsmeep were associates. I have irrefutable evidence. What do we do with that information? We set a trap, though it might be dangerous. Gather your equipment and come back later. All right. Yes? I wanted to ask you about the commander of the Royal Guards. I saw him in town some time ago, busy bashing perverts. How come? What don't you understand? Everyone knows the guard commander hates anyone he can call deviant. <coughs> Everyone knows, but few care. Yes? I find your reasoning somewhat flawed. Witcher, don't get me wrong, but this is hardly my first case. I'm in my element, been waiting in this bog for years. Hmm. I'm good at what I do. I don't go around telling you how to hunt monsters, do I? I know how to handle monsters. And I know how to handle this case. Something's been worrying me. Speak freely, Geralt. You can trust me. It's you. I have the impression you've changed. No reason to be shy? Tell me. Recently, my medallion has vibrated every time I've come here. Must be my warning amulets. Salamandra's men could attack at any moment. It vibrates a lot. A master mage made these amulets. They're not Saint Lebiota's tailbones or other crap from the market square. That's not my only concern. What else? 
There's a box of Fistech on your desk. You a user? Occasional. I started while investigating a certain Baron. Had to be on my feet day and night. Hmm. I'm not proud of it, but I can control myself. It's not a habit. That's not my only concern. What else? Why the world map on your wall? Developed an interest in international politics? Everyone should know what's going on in the world. It also improves my image. Say you were a client. What would you think when you saw that map? I am a client, and I think you're really interested in the Redania Tamaria border. You've marked it with pins. Witches' vision. I forgot. But we're not all witches. A normal person would think, what a worldly fellow. He must have worked all over. And that's the idea. That's not my only concern. What else? Hmm. Yeah, okay, so it's not a bug that my medallion always vibrates when I come in here. Yeah. I have a suspect. Spit it out, Geralt. Never mind. Alright. So the cracks begin to show with this guy. Let's investigate a little bit. He's definitely the most sketch out of any of the people that I've interacted with in this town so far. He's got that world map. He's got all this mess. And again, we see some of this trademark Witcher um, anachronisms. Uh, even though it's set in a pretty medieval setting, like nobody's running around with cell phones or anything. We have some uh, interesting concepts that are really more modern, like, uh, you know, mutations, genetics, all that jazz, but also just the whole uh, the private eye detection more approach we're dealing with here. <laughs> 